Okay, in this video, I'll answer the question, what is a mole? What is a mole? No, it's not the skin mole, it's the chemistry wala mole. Okay, now to understand what a mole is, you first have to understand what Avogadro's constant is. Okay, now Amidio Avogadro, okay, Amidio Avogadro was a chemist who gave out many, many major contributions to chemistry. Okay. And one of his creation was the Avogadro's, Avogadro's constant or Avogadro's number. All right. And that is related to the Avogadro's law, but that is for some other time. Okay. Now, all you have to know is that it's just another number which equals to, let me write that in a different color. Okay. Which equals to um, 6.0. 22 into 10 to the power 23 okay please keep this in mind or else you won't understand anything okay now it's just another number okay you don't have to be really you know, like oh my god you know you don't have to panic okay just chill okay now imagine a dozen of laddus okay let me just draw that <laughs> okay one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, and 12. Okay. This is one dozen potatoes. Okay. One dozen potatoes, which is precisely 12 potatoes. Okay. Now, what if you had one mole of potatoes? Okay. Mole is something like dozen. Okay. And one mole would like equal, okay, one mole potatoes will equal to 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 potatoes. That is Avogadro's number, right? This is Avogadro's number, which is denoted by N A, something like that. Okay. This is a mole. Okay. It's a lot. Okay. It's a, it's a, it's a lot. Okay. And that is why mole is used as a standard unit. Okay. It's an SI unit for amount of substance. Okay, for very, very small substance like atoms, okay, and molecules, okay. And that is why chemists don't say, like, give me a dozen of O2 molecules. They say, give me a mole of O2 molecules, okay. To revise, it's something like a dozen, which means 12 potatoes, but a mole means this, which is the Avocado's constant number of such things, okay. Suppose, let me just give you a quick example, okay. Suppose you said, like, give me one mole of hydrogen, you know, molecules, all right, hydrogen molecules, okay. Or you can just say, give me a mole of hydrogen, okay. This will just mean that you have 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 hydrogen molecules, okay. Now, if you, you know, read about uh, Avogadro's law, you may understand what this exactly is. All right, that's it for a mole. Okay, you know, you now understand what a mole is. Okay, congratulations. Okay.